Hello Better Mind family. In today's video, we're going to talk about something important, removing botfly larvae from animals. If you're a pet person, this information is crucial, so make sure to watch the whole video. I'll explain how this process works and also share tips on preventing it from happening to your beloved pets. Before we dive into today's informative video, I want to kindly ask you to show your support by subscribing to our channel and hitting the bell icon. By doing so, you'll stay updated with more helpful videos just like this one. How does a botfly get into the pets? Botflies have a unique way of getting into pets. The adult botflies lay their eggs on the skin or hair of animals. When the eggs come into contact with warmth and moisture, such as the body heat and moisture on an animal's fur, they hatch into tiny larvae. These newly hatched larvae can attach themselves to the animal's skin or hair and then find a way to burrow inside. They may enter through natural openings like the animal's mouth, nose, or wounds, or they can use small openings in the skin, such as hair follicles or tiny cuts. Once inside, they start their journey beneath the animal's skin or within the hair follicles. It's important to note that pets can come into contact with botfly eggs or larvae in various environments. For example, if they spend time outdoors in areas where botflies are present, they might unknowingly encounter these parasites. Additionally, certain insects or vectors that carry botfly eggs can also transfer them to animals. To minimize the risk of pets getting botfly larvae, it's a good practice to keep them away from areas where botflies are prevalent, maintain proper hygiene, and regularly check their fur and skin for any signs of infestation. Your veterinarian can provide specific guidance on preventive measures based on your pet's specific needs and living environment. Botflies can attack a variety of animals. While they typically infest mammals, including both domestic and wild animals, the specific species of botfly and its preferred hosts can vary in different regions. Some common animals that botflies target include Dogs. Botflies can infest dogs, particularly those that spend time outdoors or in rural areas. Cats. Though less common than in dogs, botflies can also affect cats. Livestock. Botflies can be a concern for livestock animals such as horses, cattle, sheep, and goats. Rabbits. Domestic rabbits and wild rabbits are susceptible to botfly infestations. Rodents. Various species of rodents, such as mice, rats, and squirrels, can be targeted by botflies. So how do we know our pets as botflies? Recognizing whether your pet has botflies can be a little challenging, but there are some signs and symptoms that can help you identify a potential infestation. Here are a few indicators to watch out for. Number one, skin lesions. Look for unusual bumps or raised areas on your pet's skin. Botfly larvae often create small openings to breathe, which can result in these distinct lesions. Number two, excessive scratching or licking. If you notice your pet excessively scratching, licking, or biting at a particular area, it could be a response to the irritation caused by the botfly larvae. Number 3. Presence of small holes. Keep an eye out for tiny holes or puncture marks on your pet's skin. These can be an indication that the botfly larvae have entered the skin. Number 4. Swelling or discomfort. Botfly infestations can cause localized swelling and discomfort in the affected area. You may notice your pet exhibiting signs of pain or tenderness. Number 5. Behavioral changes. In some cases, pets with botfly infestations may display behavioral changes. They might become more irritable, restless, or exhibit signs of discomfort. If you observe any of these signs or suspect that your pet may have botfly larvae, it is essential to seek veterinary care promptly. A veterinarian will be able to accurately diagnose the presence of botflies and provide the necessary treatment to ensure the well-being of your cherished companion. Remember, 
your veterinarian is the best resource for assessing and addressing any potential botfly infestation in your pet. They possess the expertise and knowledge to guide you through the process and help your pet find relief from any discomfort caused by these curious little creatures. By staying vigilant and seeking professional care, you can swiftly address any potential botfly issues and provide your pet with the loving care they deserve. Let's continue to keep our furry companions happy, healthy, and free from any pesky visitors like botflies. Thank you so much for joining us today. We hope you found this video valuable and informative. If you did, we kindly ask you to show your support by subscribing to our channel and liking the video. We look forward to bringing you more exciting and insightful videos in the future. Goodbye.